So, pause, collect yourself. <laughs> oh, you, uh, okay, so my ma is walking out in the road in the sunlight. She's approaching me. I'm up on the sidewalk, so she's approaching me at a tangent as we're walking along. And she's just, it, it all happened in a second or two. She just says, I'll be dead within two weeks. And in the dream, I remember her having said it before already, I think maybe from an earlier scene or something, and I'm wondering why she's repeated it. But as the uh, reality of what she's saying hits me, I get a brief pang of anxiety, and that wakes me up. And then I realize, well, she's already gone. Um, what am I going to ask? Uh, what do I make of it? No, no. Uh, oh, these guys, okay. Yeah. Brad? Yeah. Um, is there a problem? Um, what's it like uh, when you see your mom walking out in the sunlight? Thank you. Go ahead. Here. What's that like? No. Uh, well, it all happens so fast, but initially, initially, there's a little bit of a surprise because she's kind of, you know, it's, oh, okay, orienting to it. And then, um, she's, um, I'm interested, I'm focused. She looks young, like she's 30. Um, she's in a summer blouse, probably like she, like she did look when I was five or six. Um, and she's, she's looking good. I, I, hesitate to say, I hesitate to say beatific, but she's approaching it. Uh, would you answer his question? Well, he seemed happy with my... Uh... That's it. <laughs> <laughs> Go ahead. Go back. Well, whenever anybody asks me a question twice, I, I, it's incumbent upon me to say, um, what was it about my answer that you found insufficient, Bradley? I'll help you. Okay. Uh, there were uh, <clears throat> uh, there were a lot of clouds, and it was uh, uh, kind of foggy and misty. And uh, no, no, it was bright. What? It was very bright. Was, uh, what was does a, that mean? Actually, the 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 street I think she was on was State College, just right across from the medical center. It gets very bright out there in, in Anaheim in the afternoons. Um, I, when did you, uh, are you recalling other times when you experienced things that, that were that bright? <clears throat> yes, it, I am. I would say that it's a very bright summer day, but I've experienced that many times. Yeah, you experienced that kind of thing many times in the past. Well, what, um, you're focusing on the sunlight and the brightness, right? Yeah. Yes. I would say yes. Yeah. And among those times, where would you place this one? Well, I see where you're going with this, but the thing is that there were many times that I used to stand out on the sidewalk across from the medical center waiting for a bus, and it's bright sunlight. It's just exactly like that. There's nothing... That's good. That's all. We're not talking... Yeah, but she's approaching you. Yeah, she's actually on the road coming towards... Yeah, right. Yeah. 
No. So would you add to that, please? Well, that part is unusual. It would not be good for her to be out on state college <laughs> walking in the road, but she's quickly getting off of it. Yeah, she's in the middle of the road. Now well, she's in the last lane. She's like, it's like we're walking together, and she's kind of getting closer and closer, and she'll eventually jump up on the curb. This all, this all happens in like three seconds, so. That's good. Uh, what does that add to the story? Well, what could it add? Yeah. Uh, uh, well, it, it could add that, you know, she's out in the road. She could be dead in not just two weeks. She could be dead in a couple seconds. Is potentially dangerous. Exactly. Yeah, yeah, good. Thank you. Except I don't remember any cars on that. No, that's good, but in the uh, dream. Yeah. So no cars, right? What said of mine then is she in? There are no cars. She's well, now in it's kind of unclear because the reason this part is unclear because on the one hand what I wrote is I remember having her having said this before so why are you saying it twice but on the other hand I I think I asked her which I did not write down You're like what do you mean by that mm -hmm. I, I have a, a state of puzzlement about it and I can't remember you know, it's unclear to me which of those happened, didn't happen, or in order. It's kind of all mixed in. But I remember, I think I had a, you know, I'm puzzled about it. So would and you, also would that you she's agree repeating. Your question makes sense in terms of the dream. Well, I have two questions, mm -hmm. I think. One is, why are you repeating yourself? And the other is, um, what do you mean you're going to be dead in two weeks? Like, why, how, how do you know that? You know. Yeah, but given the circumstances, the way you perceived her, what you're seeing doesn't look like there's someone who's going to die in two weeks. Yeah, it? no, there's definitely an incongruity there. Pardon? There is an incongruity there. Nothing. It's... So... Uh, like, it doesn't seem to be bothering her. She's just matter-of-factly telling me yeah. this. Yeah. yeah. It doesn't change her... Um, As a matter of fact, of all the times you've seen her looking good, where would you put this one? Well, as you ask, ask that question, what comes to mind for me is that the expression that she has on her face in this dream is very business-like, matter-of-fact, like this is just the way it's going to be. And compared to waking life, um, that wouldn't be the case. She was, she tried to be brave about it, but she was deathly scared about death and we had conversations about what happens afterwards um, and she was uh, not of the opinion that anything happens afterwards and she was scared about that in waking life but here she's young bright moving quickly taking me along with her as we right and uh, just letting me know in a very business-like, non-emotional way. So I would say that compared to waking life, that would be unusual. No. Uh, positively. Well, it would... <clears throat> yes, positively. Yeah. No. A matter of fact, yeah. the way you talk 
talking about it, she's taking you along with her. Yeah, we're kind of, you know, doing this. And I, it's almost as if I have to kind of catch up with her. Yeah, yeah, yeah. She's moving. Right. Positively. Um, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. And you have to catch up. I have to catch up and I have to question her. And I'm really not getting anywhere with the questions. Um, yeah, she's, she's busting a move. She's moving along. Mm -hmm. And uh, matter of fact. Mm hmm means go ahead, that she... Well, the other question I have is why are you telling me? If you even, if you do know this, why are you telling me? I mean, I think there are so many questions that it opens up. It all happens so instantly, but if you unpack it all, I think, you know, like, why are you telling me? And... Um, what are you going to do with the time you have left? What am I going to do with the time I have left? Um, how do you expect me to react? Um, it's great. You're not freaked out. Normally you would be. Why aren't you freaked out? There, there's just so many questions that come out of that yeah. instant. Yeah. Yeah. But uh, if, if she remains in that state, what happens to your question? Like, what are you going to be, why are you telling me this? You can, is she not telling you in a very positive state that she's in? Yeah. Is she in fact ideal? Yeah. 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 She's become ideal in your dream. Huh? And in the state of mind, that finish it. Yeah, well, are you her state of mind or yeah, mine? Yeah, hers. Well, <clears throat> see, what's interesting is the last talk that you and I did was Saturday a couple weeks ago, and. Um, What came up then was indifference. Um, and especially, she can be very caring and motherly, play the mother role many times. Uh, but when the shit hits the fan, she drops out of that. Yeah. And it goes into indifferent mode. In fact, sometimes disdainful mode. Um, well, one would think that the situation that she's now describing about herself is the ultimate of crises in her world, especially given how she normally thinks about reality. And yet she's, well, it's hard to tell whether she is an ideal and she's handling this in a way that is an ideal way or whether she's actually just being indifferent again. But she looks bright, she looks good. Uh, she she always looked bright and good. That's the problem is that she put on this, this act my whole childhood. Except? Except when, except except when with, crises happen. That's when she showed. Yeah, thank you. Therefore, she's showing finish it. But this is not happening in That's this That's not happening. She's the exact opposite of what she exact normally opposite. is in a crisis. Yeah. She's in an ideal <coughs> state of mind for dealing with that issue, which is totally different than her way of being. Yeah, she's not, she's not freaking out. Nope. Matter of fact, does that mean she can accept her death? 
she has accepted it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But it's not slowing, <clears throat> slowing her down. Nope. You have to catch up with her. Rather good person to uh, catch up with. To emulate, yes. <laughs> she always was. <laughs> but only this time. Yeah, it's the not most make important. Believe. Yeah. I'm sorry, only this time it's what? not make believe. <clears throat> I don't know how real are dreams. I don't know. Well, it's just, you know, who knows about dreams? <laughs> so answer, now answer your question. What do you mean by that? I think we've discussed what she means by yeah. that. Yeah. Well, I better catch up. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks, sir. Good. Thank you for passing them around. Good. You have one here. Yeah, I'll take it. <coughs> ah, good. Yeah. Well, that way I can read it, both of yeah, you know, them. This is hers. I don't have an extra one. Yeah, okay. Sorry. Copy? Done? Got a copy? Sean, was this copy on the table a copy, or is it yeah. necessary for your... Oh, yeah. No, I have mine. Oh, this is the other one. This is Philip. Oh, is this? Yeah, that's good. I'm good. Okay, we're together. These are two dreams. Okay, want to read it aloud, please? Yeah. Uh, all right, so I was up in Washington State, and I was with a group of men, and I had been looking at a map, and I remember seeing the names of these towns in Washington. They were very clever and unique and funny, names for places. So we were out in this rural area, and we were, I guess, in this barn. We all gathered around a pickup truck, and the pickup truck had a load of dirt in it from, from somewhere. And I was looking at the load of dirt standing on the passenger side of the truck, and I saw the biggest gold chunk I've ever seen. I saw it in the dirt. I knew it was there. It was huge. And I remember it was very square, almost like a cube. It was very cubed, cube-esque, and it had this, uh, it had a face like granite, like half dome. It was cubed, but it was very raw, like it, it, had, it had just come from the dirt. And I saw it, and I didn't say anything because I knew, I knew they were going to see it soon, and they did. They saw it like five seconds immediately after. They all started cheering and saying, oh my God, look at that. Oh my God, look at that. And all these guys were cheering, uh, celebrating. And later on, I told, I told Philly about it. And I said, and I was recalling the story of finding the gold. And I said, yeah, they gave me like 40,000 for just standing around. And I wasn't really even doing anything. And they gave me 40,000. That's dream one. No, that's good. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, what do you make of it? Well, um, excuse me.
curious that I could see, I could see it. I knew I was the first one to know. I think that's curious, but I didn't say anything because I wanted to see them see it for themselves. So I didn't say like, oh, there's the bull. Um, Doesn't seem very meaningful. Hmm. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> to me, I mean, it's just, no. you know. No. Mm. Yeah, maybe it was meant for someone else. What? Maybe it was meant for someone else. Well, there were other people in the truck. <laughs> <laughs> no. Take the second paragraph, okay? Mm -hmm. Go ahead. And I was looking at the load of dirt standing on the passenger side of the truck, and I saw the biggest gold chunk I've ever seen. I saw it in the dirt. I knew it was there. It was huge. And I remember it was very square, almost like a cube. Very cubed, cubesque, and it had this face like granite, like half dome. It was very, it was cubed, but it was very raw, like it had just come from the dirt. And I saw it, I didn't say anything because I knew, I knew they were going to see it soon, and they did. They saw it like five seconds immediately after. They all started cheering and saying, oh my God, look at that, look at that. What was it like uh, viewing when you saw it? What did it do to you? Uh, it had this sort of like magnetism to it. Like the scene had this, uh, it was, it was like seeing Half Dome in Yosemite. It was just totally captivating, this whole, this big chunk of gold. It was fascinating. Um, had kind of a magnetism to it. Mm -hmm. yeah, like what? What did it do to you? I felt like we were on to something that, like I felt like it was the biggest chunk of gold ever found in his, in humanity, almost. Yeah. But it was only, I mean, it was only like that big, but that's, that's big, you know, yeah. for a gold standard. Like, <laughs> like, uh, you could hold it. Yeah, you could pick it up. It was like this big. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Uh, what did it do to you when you saw it like that? You could hold it and grab onto it? Did you in the dream, or did you just see that you could have? No, I didn't in the dream. I just saw it in the... No. I never touched it. No. But I, I just saw it. I looked at it. That's good. Go, 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 go. So it was captivating and fascinating. I asked you about the magnetism, and you were going to say something about it. I was going to say it looked like a, a Picasso, the face of it like a Picasso painting. How it was had all these different ridges and really subtle, pretty, yet strange. Um, so as a work patterns. of art, how would you look? Come on. As uh, it was the highest, yeah, for sure. As art? It's yeah, as art. As art, as something that's just created from, from the, the earth. 
It's oh, give it a quite, grade. It's quite amazing. A? Is oh. it A? 10? Yeah. Oh. Um, well, why did you say magnetism? It's a rather curious word. Um, I couldn't stop looking at it, really. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. It was cap cap captivating. It uh -huh. captured my, uh, my eye, I would say. Now, what did it do? Captivated your eyes? Yeah, I got yeah. that. More? Ever have that kind of experience before? Yeah. Huh? Yeah. I think so. No. It fits in with other experiences that you've had in the past. Mm -hmm. Right? Where would you put this one? It was up, up top, yeah. Mm -hmm. oh. uh, you waited for them to see it. Mm -hmm. That must have been an interesting moment. Go ahead. What was that like? Well, it was fun because I like um, knowing things before other people do so that I can watch them see it for the first time and experience something. It's, that's something I've always liked. So, this is something you always enjoy doing, mm -hmm. right? So, it's a high point in doing that. Yeah. Right? Yeah. 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 Among the occasions, this is, finish it. Yeah, they're going to watch the, it's yeah, like, watch. watch this, their yeah. minds are going to be blown, and I know yeah. that they're... <laughs> yeah, they're going to blow gonna, them, gonna, this is going to blow their minds, yeah. right? So that's way up it's there. It's like five it? seconds of like, wait till they see yeah. this, this is... <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I think Jeff was there. Oh. He's not here tonight. So. Oh. Huh. Anyway. Oh. And then you, do you notice that last paragraph? Uh, Go ahead, read it. All these guys were celebrating, and later on I told, I told Philly about it, and I was recalling the story of finding the gold, and I said, yeah, they gave me like 40,000 just for standing around, and I wasn't really even doing anything. They just gave me 40,000. See? What was that like? You got forty thousand dollars for just standing around. That's awesome. <laughs> well, come on, awesome. Come on. <laughs> Same question. It's it's just like luck, like uh, just or uh, yeah, good fortune or right place at the right time. Providence, I guess. That might be putting it at a higher state. Well, I, that's a <laughs> Just thing. like, yeah. It's like Providence. Yeah. You did nothing to do, get I it. I didn't do anything. It came as a gift, as it were. Yeah, I was just being lazy. Yeah, you didn't have to do anything. Yeah. I waited <laughs> for other people to wake up. Yeah. Huh. Yeah. Oh. Rather... Yeah, just uh, for hanging around. Yeah. Rather ideal, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> Certainly, I <ideal>. Another <laughs> ideal dream. Yeah. I can't find a problem in it. Well, I'm sorry about that. <laughs> 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 this may be providential. Yeah. Right? I hope so. It looks like you're going to, you'll, you'll see. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, that's fun. Hold it. You have your, yeah, wait a minute. Okay.
Philly, two three. Uh, Well, why don't you? Now, this should, you have to be relaxed because this is <laughs> a very long one. <laughs> mm. Yeah, okay, so, ready? Yeah. At the stream last night? Mm. I had gotten these New Balance shoes. Okay, I'll just run in them. Like, yeah. That's it. That's it? That's it. Do it again. I had gotten these New Balance shoes. What's it like? Come on. It's like, how the hell did I get these? <laughs> Kind of. Because they were New Balance, which means what to you? A whole bunch of things, but uh, like I think they're the best running shoe. But there's some problems with them as well. <laughs> what then? Come on, what? I think it's the best running shoe, but there's some pro like in the dream or what? In what? the dream. Well, in the dream, it's more like, how the hell did I get these? Like, uh, where did these come from? Um... <laughs> Go on. I think I had them on actually already. And, uh, yeah, I was wondering, like, I was wondering. What's that like? Like, kind of like, where, how did I get these? <laughs> because in the dream, looking at them and seeing that these are the best running shoes, well, they're well, yeah. What? They're, what? Uh, yeah. It's, they're what? Uh, Say it again. They're well made. Thank you. More? You've got them. You're on. I mean, like, but in the, anyway, I don't know if this is important, in the real world, that I see actually issues with them, but. Yeah, in the dream, that helps, but put it in the dream. Yeah, there were 990s. There were 990s, I think. Which, which is like, a, yeah, it's a, it's a good running shoe compared to all the other junk, like. Yeah, yeah. Therefore, like, I, like, I've been, like, I kind of study these because I want the best one, so. And after my evaluation, uh, <laughs> I've concluded that, yeah, they make the, probably the best one. Even though there's still some issues. <laughs> I see. <laughs> what did you do? Yeah, I was just like, well, how the heck did these get on my feet? You know, how did I get these shoes? Yeah, I know that. What did it do to you? The effect, come on. Come on, see? I was just puzzled. I was just puzzled and had no idea how I got these shoes or more or less even how they're on my feet. Like I, and I was looking at the back of them. I was like, yeah, oh, those are like. Because when you looked at them, 
they were terribly warm and shoddy, shoddy. And no, they're ready. Oh, oh, what? They're built ready. Ready. Yeah, more. Come on. Built ready to go. Built ready to run. Built ready to get down to business, you know, like. I like the design of them, too, yeah, what, you know. Yeah, what's well, that, 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 about the design? Come on. That it's crafted. It's designed for, right, this activity. Very specific. Oh. 990s. <laughs> yeah. 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 990s. That's yeah, the nine, model. 990s. Yeah, 990s. <laughs> and I've done a lot of research. Because yeah, for yeah. Mo like Trump's behind New Balance, I don't like that, and so yeah. I, you know I've tried to like wiggle around, like find a better one, yeah. and I haven't been so, able to do it. ideal, isn't it? Yeah, and then I watch people walking right? in them and how they yeah. work and everything. Yeah. Uh, did you answer the question I asked you? What it was like for you to have gained this as a result of all of these things coming together? I thought so. I was, I was I'll help you. Uh, yeah, I realized all of this was true, but I was kind of bored with the whole thing. Uh, did I help? No. Well, you didn't do what you wanted. Hey, by the way, have you ever gotten things in the past? <laughs> sure. Yeah, a got few. a couple of them? Yeah. Where would you put this one? Given the circumstances, yeah. See, but you, you're not looking at them. You have them. You already got them. Yeah, they're on my feet. Yeah. 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 And you're wondering where they came from. <laughs> right. Right? How the hell did I get them? But you already got them. Is that right? What is the dream telling you, sir? I'm wearing, I already have, I'm wearing uh, what I most want yeah. Yeah, or desire. I do. Yeah. You already are, you already have something. What do you call it again? Yeah, ideal. Oh. Best. Oh, Ben. Yeah. Do you have to wonder how you got them? My, but you're now ready to go, aren't you? Wow. It's ready to go. You're ready to go. Oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> go, man. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> to turn up the volume. Okay. Um, we're in a classroom and PG was up in front of the class giving a talk. There was some discussion and I remember a question was being posed to him and he said, a little stimulation. Like not an answer to the question, but like he was taking a break. He started taking pills, look like vitamins and he walked to the middle of the classroom to a desk to drink a mug of water. While class was going on, people who were sitting on the far left row of the room were closest to these large windows. The people, in, the, the people sitting in the last three seats towards the back were leaning over and looking outside the window, and you could hear some sort of commotion going on outside. It almost seemed like recess or something, but from what I could see, they were high school aged. 
Those same three people made an oh gasping type of exclamation like something had happened. I guess there were people outside trying to dance on a ledge or some type of table surface outside of those windows and someone fell. I thought it was a young woman. I could tell that people outside were running to the scene and the impression that I got was that it was a bad fall. When I got outside, it ended up being a small child that had fallen on his head and we were all worried for him because that was a big drop. There was a crowd of people hovering over to find out the condition of the boy and then the boy emerged and he was fine. He, was, he had no shirt on, and his head was wet, almost as if he had that look about him when babies are first born. He had that kind of moisture to his face and hair, and then he was skipping away. He seemed to be in, a good, he seemed to be in good physical condition. I remember being surprised that he was doing so well. My brother approached me and said we had to go. I don't remember where we were going. Okay, we'll hold the other for later. Sure. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What, what do you make of it? <laughs> well, in the first part, I wish I could remember the question, mm -hmm. but it was a good question. And it's a good question. Yeah, it was a really good question. <clears throat> good, huh? And you didn't answer it. You said a little stimulation, and you walked away from it. <laughs> No. <laughs> and then there yeah. was that yeah. 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 An, another event that happened yeah. outside. Yeah. yeah. Then the episode on the ledge. Right. Right. Um, yeah. Uh, talk about the baby. Yeah, I, I couldn't see. I uh, see. At first, I didn't know it was a baby. I thought it was a, a woman. And then when I got outside, what I could make from it is that it was a child. Mm -hmm. And then when I saw him with my own eyes. Uh, it was remarkable. He just looked like remarkable. Nothing happened to him. Nothing. He was just remarkable. <laughs> it was amazing that he was fine. Yeah. What did that do to you? Um. I remember in the dream I was smiling oh, really good, big. Oh, good, 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 good. I always liked it. <laughs> and that I was really happy that he was okay. What do you make of the baby? Remember how you described it and everything? Oh, yeah. He had no shirt on. <laughs> and yeah. His head was wet and... As if he was a... A baby. Newborn. Well, yeah, as a newborn. Yeah. 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 What do you make of that? Well, newborns have very soft, fragile heads. So if you drop them, that's really catastrophic for them. Yeah. So. Like a miracle. Yeah. <laughs> what did you do to see that? Uh, Come on. I think I was just really in a state of shock, like, wow, how did he survive that? And look at how good he looks. He, yeah. He's skipping away. And like, a baby to skip away after that <laughs> yeah. is certainly <laughs> remarkable, right? Right, yeah. Right, yeah. He had this uh, happiness to him, too. Yeah. Like, Very happy. Yeah. Yeah. How happy? He almost seemed like he was glowing. Glowing. Yeah. And yeah. Sh shining. Well, they're glowing and shining. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah more.
Got more color. glowing, shining. And he seemed to be so free from what just happened yeah, to him. Yeah, and free. Yeah. Right? There's, like, you could, he wasn't suffering from what just happened to him. Yeah. It's almost as if nothing happened to nothing. him. Nothing? And, matter of fact? It's like, he dropped it. <laughs> yeah. Like, whatever yeah. happened to him. Ideal? Know? Yeah. Another ideal dream? We only have one or two of them <laughs> a night, right? Hmm. Now let's have fun. Okay. Let's agree to ignore the first part. <laughs> okay? You can agree. <laughs> okay? No. 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 <laughs> All right, go ahead. What am I going to ask you? I don't know. What are you going to ask me? Hmm. What was it like? No. No. Um, how did it make me feel? How did it make me feel? Yeah, okay. <laughs> no, go ahead, come on. Oh, okay. No, this is a dream where it is essential that you stay with the words in the dream. So tell me, in terms of the dream, the first part, what is going on? There is a discussion in the classroom and there's a very important question that's being asked. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And it was a really good question. Everybody wanted to know what you, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. what PG had to say. No. Yeah. Go ahead. Everyone wanted to know. Right. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Now, you're missing one word. And if you don't focus on that word, you're going to miss the dream. The response to the question was, it wasn't, I guess it was an answer. What, what? I guess it was an answer. What, what, what do you mean? What, what was an answer? <laughs> when PG said, a little stimulation. What does that mean? That's right. Give me, talk about that. The expression. Come on, talk about the expression. A little stimulation. And then PG pointed down at the, the vitamins. And he... And therefore, this is the... The answer, I guess. Tangent? Tangent? No, no, no. answer. That's, that's a, oh, that's the stimulation. Oh. That's, <laughs> yeah. Okay, now... See if we can un unpack it now. You're right. Okay. Okay, there's really a good question. Everybody wanted to know about it. Then the dude goes through this. Stim a little stimulation. Right, so we should find the answer in this, shouldn't we? The vitamins and the water. Yeah. Hmm. 
So talk about that scene and the dream. Right? Everything you can about that moment. Well, so PG starts to take the vitamins slowly. And, slowly, go yeah, ahead. And everyone's waiting on PG, wondering. Um, and then PG starts taking the vitamins and is looking down as if he's in a know, he he looks like he's thinking about something while he's walking to the middle of the classroom where he takes the mug of water and starts to drink it and then everyone just kind of lets lets it go just doesn't doesn't register right I don't think anyone realizes that that was the answer I now think they're gotta, still waiting for the now you've got to tell me what's going on see that's good okay. so uh, <clears throat> how did he look doing that I'll help you uh, he was frowning coughing headache no. weary fatigue no? no well go ahead tell me when he said a little stimulation, he had a smile on his face. Um, it was almost like a riddle. Um. Uh -huh. And uh, more. So there he is looking at him. <coughs> Looks like he's smiling. He's like presenting a riddle. Yeah. And how did he look compared at this point to previously with the class? What was, what was that oh, translation? Yeah. That difference? Um A, it's a different type of... En what, what? He was engaged differently. Engaged differently. That's what I want to know. Go ahead. So with the classroom, with the class, he was very... It's not like he was... Hmm. Hmm. But it's almost like he, like he, it was like taking a break. It, it changed yeah. the pace yeah. of. Change in pace. Go ahead. Yeah. Um, but smiling. Yeah. And as if presenting a riddle. Yeah. No, no, no. He's taking the pills very slowly and sipping the water. Yeah, it's almost in the dream. It's. Hmm. I don't want to add into it. So. By the way, stay where you are. What is it like if he is really? being asked a good question and does that as the answer a little stimulation. stimulation well hmm. like it wasn't a dog bone <laughs> no it looked mm -hmm. like it was what vitamin yeah, it was vitamin. It was? Yeah. Yeah, mm -hmm. what's, what's that? I don't, I'm not familiar with that word. Vitamins? Um, health supplements? <laughs> oh, some kind of health supplement? Yeah. Go ahead. That's good. Go ahead. Mm. Um, P. 
People take vitamins to make them feel better. Hmm. He's answering the question. Is he taking care of himself? He's taking care of himself? Yeah. Good. More. I like that. Um, and He's concerned then with his own what? With his own health. Huh? Well, he's concerned with himself, with his own health, but before answering. With himself. Yeah. Right. He's doing yeah. something to take care of himself. Right. That makes him. To feel healthy. Him feel better. Feel good. It's a healthy thing. Yeah. He's demonstrating health <laughs> and how to feel better. Right? By taking care focusing of by taking care of himself. Isn't that an interesting way to answer a question? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. What is your dream master telling you about a good question? What is it good for? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Finish it? To take care of yourself. So look inwards. To Good. Yeah. Right. And this is another example of the same thing. Yeah. It is. That's a new bird. Yeah. Sure. Thank Good. you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Pleasure. <laughs> We need this. Where's yours? No. No? No? Gone? No, no, no. Oh, I had a press one. It's still on my tape machine. Mm -hmm. I did it in the toilet. <laughs> <laughs> so it echoes. <laughs> I'll have to take it down and write it out. When okay, it's tomorrow? Maybe, yeah. Okay, all right. Ah. Hey, uh, sir, uh, do you have to bring a dream with you, sir? <coughs> no. no? Hmm. Did your sister bring one? No. Hmm. Okay, I thought what we might do tonight is take a look.